In recent news, concerns have been raised about the alarming delays in Royal Mail services, with real-life consequences affecting individuals and their access to crucial services. This video delves into the issues highlighted by various sources, examining the impact of these delays on public life and, in particular, the healthcare sector. The video from BBC News sheds light on the growing concerns surrounding Royal Mail delays, citing instances where individuals have faced significant challenges due to late deliveries. The issues extend beyond mere inconvenience, as delays have led to missed appointments and, in some cases, critical medical procedures. One poignant example highlighted by The Telegraph involves a young boy who missed a vital surgery due to delays in Royal Mail services. The heartbreaking story narrates how the boy's family experienced the repercussions of postal delays firsthand, emphasizing the need for reliable and timely mail services, especially when it comes to matters of life and death. The Swindon advertiser further amplifies the public outcry against the diabolical Royal Mail Service, recounting a resident's experience of missing a crucial appointment due to delays in mail delivery. The frustration and anger expressed by the affected individuals highlight the broader implications of postal inefficiencies on the community's well-being. These incidents not only underscore the immediate challenges faced by individuals but also shed light on the broader implications for healthcare services. The ripple effect of postal delays can lead to increased strain on healthcare providers, affecting their ability to deliver timely and essential services to patients. To resolve these issues, it is crucial to identify and address the root causes of Royal Mail delays. This may involve a comprehensive review of the postal system, from logistics and sorting processes to staffing and resource allocation. Timely and efficient mail delivery is not just a matter of convenience, it is a fundamental aspect of ensuring public health and well-being.